Hi friends, this is Mohammed Shakil here and in this tutorial I'm going to talk about folding and unfolding of sheet metal components in the generative shape design workbench I mean generative sheet metal design workbench in KTAV5 Sometimes you need to perform operations like cut out, hole and so on on the bend faces of the wall as shown over here Here in this case, this is a bend sheet metal and for example if you wanted a rectangle which is maybe uh, 200 by 75 and you wanted that particular cutout on this bend face so you cannot achieve that once you create the sheet metal and bend it so you need to unfold and once you do the cutout you need to fold it once again so in this tutorial I'm going to show you how you can perform that simple operation and how that operation is very important when you're working with the generative sheet metal design workbench. So to start off, I'll close the file which I was working on and I'll open up a new part. You can switch back to generative sheet metal design. So first of all, first thing first, setting up the sheet metal parameters. So you can just go for the default and click on the sketch and create a base sheet metal you can give thickness for that sheet metal there and then select the edge and give a wall on edge you can maybe decrease the height also what you can do is you can uh, create a flange where you can increase the radius so I'm going for the flange because I have an option of increasing the radius just increase the length so that's not all the the important part so once we have got this particular sheet metal you can see it's a wall and here a wall on edge or a flange so here we have a particular radius say for example we need a rectangular cut out over here so how would you be able to achieve it if you are not able to select the plane with which you need to sketch so basically for doing the cutout as I've shown you previously if you have any doubts on performing the cutout operation then you need to go back to my previous tutorial and find out how you can do a cutout operation first so how you'll be, you'll be doing it is you'll select this face and you'll go for the sketch and you'll be creating the rectangular or whatever uh, profile where you want to do but in this case you cannot you cannot find the other side because it's already bent what you can do is go for unfolding go for select all anyways there is only one face here and select a reference face you can select this as your reference face and click on OK now this is unfolded what you could do now is select this face and now go for sketch and then create whatever cutout profile where you want to do and then go for the cutout operation you could also select the cutout from here just click on OK and you have the cutout now the important part is folding it once again back to the normal fold again in the bending toolbar you have folding operation just uh, beside the unfolding similar fashion select select all and select the reference face and click on OK and you get the fold now you can see that the sheet metal is beautifully cut out over here so I hope this tutorial is going to help you perform folding and unfolding 
operation without any mistakes and if you have any doubts regarding this you can comment below the video and I'll be getting in touch with you if you have any uh, further clarifications or anything which you would like to uh, ask me you can write to me at ketia.pro.user at gmail.com and any project inquiries also are welcome and thank you so much for watching and stay tuned